Hello everyone! Today I'm going to talk to you about using your reading tools in Achieve 3000. When you get to step two, reading the article, you are going to notice that you have several tools to use when interacting with the text. This blue icon is going to appear after every paragraph. You are going to use this tool to make reading connections. When you make a reading connection, you can either choose to summarize the paragraph that you just read, generate questions about the paragraph you just read, or set the purpose for the paragraph that you just read. One note on setting the purpose. When using this tool, your notes are going to automatically go to your thought question. So be careful when using this one. I'm going to show you an example. Whenever I set the purpose, it's important to read the question. As you read, think about the information in the article. Do you think it would be good to use the Nintendo DS in the classroom? You are going to write your answer here. Yes, I think that using the Nintendo DS would help engage the students. Okay, I'm going to click Save. Remember to click Save anytime you make any reading connection so your teacher can see that you completed the work. So let's see how setting the purpose affects your thought question. I'm going to scroll up, go to this fifth step, the thought question, and notice it already appeared that setting the purpose reading connection I made as notes. Just be aware of that one. Okay, back to our reading tools. You also are going to notice that you have a toolbar on the side. This top part of the toolbar is so you can have the article read to you. We do suggest that you read along with the article as you listen to the audio being read to you. The first thing to do when having the, uh, the text read to you, you want to click this button. This is going to help you select the part of the article that you want read to you. Then you're going to click play. Click this stop button to have the audio turned off. If you want the audio to go a little bit slower, click the slow option. A little bit faster, click the fast option. Please reach out to me or any of your teachers if you have any questions about the reading connections and the top part of the toolbar. The bottom part of the toolbar is so you can highlight a word, a sentence, or a whole paragraph in an article. What you need to do is first select what color you would like to highlight. Then find the sentence, word, or paragraph you need to highlight. Then click that highlighting button again and you will notice it appears. Again, please reach out to your teacher either in chat or email if you have any questions about these tools. Happy reading!